Hi there. This is a response video. It's not like anything I've ever done before, but this needs to re be responded to, especially in light of the video I just created a few minutes ago. You may want to go back and look at that video uh, talking about the choices that uh, Tesla and Elon need to make among all of the cornucopia of opportunities that they have. I'm Randy Kirk, and uh, if you like this kind of content, please like it. Um, okay, let's t let's dig in. Do you uh, you may not have even heard the news yet? So the news is is that Tesla is expanding the Gigafactory in Reno, Nevada. Uh, they're adding another substantial uh, 3.5 million feet to that facility. That's huge. Uh, it will be consist of two factories. One factory will be for semi-trucks and the other factory will be for another 100 gigawatts of 4680 batteries. That was <laughs> completely out of the blue. Nobody expecting it. I mean, again, if we go back and look at some of my old videos, you'll, you'll see that if we're going to pedal to the metal towards one terawatt of U.S. production of batteries, well, you got to start building more lines. Here's the key. Don't know if anybody else will mention this to you, but here's the key. You don't make that commitment in Reno if you have any question in your mind about the line in Austin ramping up to the full 100 uh, gigawatts capacity. So they know it's a done deal. That's that, that, that's out. You just know that at this point, it's a done deal. Whether it's 100% done by the end of this year or whether it's done in six months or three months, who knows? Maybe we'll get more information tomorrow. But that clearly tells us they have 100% confidence that the 4680 line is going to be producing great batteries uh, and producing them at full scale shortly. Now, uh, let me say right away that this is kind of like a news breaking deal and there's a little confusion out there. Some very good reporters are suggesting that this is not at Gigo, at, not at, at Reno, that this is at farther north and in, in way up in Northern Nevada. It may be, maybe that's, and maybe that's something else. Maybe there's two things going on here. The, the blog, and I'll put the uh, link below, the blog says that there will be two new factories. They talk about everything in terms of Sparks and the growth of Sparks and how they started Sparks. And now they're growing it some more and they're gonna be adding a lot of employees there. So from my understanding, this is all at Sparks, not somewhere else. It does not include anything at this point, at least other than the semi and 4680 batteries, but hey, that is extremely good news that they're going to build 4680 batteries there. Um, is this, a, somebody asked, is this a partnership with uh, Panasonic? We have no information on that at all. Uh, my guess is no. My guess would be no if they're, uh, even though Panasonic's right in the same building, and uh, uh, I don't think, Panasonic's already got one or two additional factories that they're in the process of building. So I'm speculating that no, this is 100% a Tesla project. Also with regard to semi, I'm gonna say this factory, they're, they're gonna spend 3.5 billion. That is one third of the total amount that they're gonna spend at Austin, Texas. Total for the entire facility in Austin, Texas. It is not just about 50,000 Tesla semi trucks. It is way more than 50,000 Tesla semi-trucks that are going to be made in this facility. The amount of square feet suggests that it's going to be way more. I don't think it takes as many square feet to make a Tesla semi-truck as it does uh, to make other vehicles. Um, so maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm 100% wrong. Maybe it takes more. Uh, and I'll, I, <laughs> it's all speculation. So, uh, but talk about great news. Uh, the day before earnings, there are so many things that we want to hear tomorrow in the earnings call. Uh, some of that has now been uh, taken care of. We now know that at least this is a substantial addition, apparently to Giga Nevada in in uh, Sparks, Nevada. Uh, it is in addition to, I'm assuming, to whatever's happening in Mexico. It's in addition to whatever has been potentially going to happen up in Canada. It's in addition to whatever other factories around the world that they may have in mind, gigafactories that may be getting ready to be announced, such as Indonesia. Uh, so uh, Tesla is going out on every possible direction. I'm so excited about the semi-factory. 
Um, and uh, maybe you can suggest in the comments below what you think in terms of can they, uh, is this for more than 50,000 a year? I'm hoping it's for 250,000 a year. That would be my, my, uh, my hopium, <laughs> but I have no idea. So I, I thought I should bring this to you uh, as quickly as possible. Um, and uh, please comment, love the comments, like it if you like it. And I still need lots more people in the uh, in my group of uh, of, um, of folks <laughs> in my Patreon group. Okay, so join the Patreon group. It's been a great talk. Oh, and buy the book. Here's the book. Don't forget to buy the Elon Musk mission. You need to buy the book in able to really truly understand everything that I talk about on this channel.